Hey guys, let's see, bringing you another video. Well, that was quick. Welcome back to the main account. Playing Malzar because I was blind pick, as always. And we, yeah, so Malzar just a solid blind pick. It's the last, obviously, rank week of the season. So we're try harding and just focusing up. Um, generally, my champion pool is going to go quite low. So you're just going to get the same champion and commentary. So this week worth of content. So for mid lane, it's going to be mainly Anivia and mouths but there will be like an occasional Vigar game if it just makes sense like it did the last game against the Soraka mid um and then support mainly going to be Renata and Amumu comp wise both comps are a little bit funky I'd never really pair an Ash with a Draven and then there's a Cheese Akshan top lane and then Vi is also a bit weird to see a good guy naughty so presume is a Nautilus one trick but maybe auto filled also Zed jungle is a bit rare does have jungle scaling nowadays but wouldn't usually put him in the jungle we might get all scaled is the only problem because they have Viga varus seraphine hey mira that is a, a scary trio of champions But we have a Scion. If he goes proper tank Scion, then he might nearly actually become unkillable. Vi definitely should go tanky. What? Tear start Viga. That's not good. Well, it's okay, but like he's not obviously looking for any kills on me. Who's a better team comp? Both comps are weird. So like the enemy comp has conventional, but then has a cheese action. Our comp is conventional. But we have like a Zed jungle and I don't know. Both comps are just a bit peculiar. How good is the emails change? Really good. It's genuinely the reason that I've started playing a bit of Mal's again. Like I've always floated with Mal Zahar when like I'm blind pick mid lane, but the buff has been so nice when it genuinely covers off my main weakness as a player. Last hitting. What was the E change? Uh, Malzahar stop now executes minions at a certain amount of health. So right now, if a minion hits 21 health and the tick happens, you have, the tick has to happen. So you can still miss minions. The tick has to happen, but it's obviously just so much more frequent to get the farm. Like that, I didn't get that one because the tick. The minion died to other minions before a tick came through. What difference to Teemo being classed as a non cheese pick, but Akshan is designed for the role. Teemo's designed as a top laner, Akshan's designed as a mid laner. Wait, yeah, Teemo's designed as a top laner, Akshan's designed as a mid laner. Wait, is that what's that happened? The Draven lane's losing the early game. That's depressing. Oh my god. Scion's already died to a gank. Draven's already died in the 2v2. This is bad. Varus name is familiar. Yeah, I think we played it. Well, that was weird lag. I think we played against or with this Varus. I recognize the BMW E30. Um, apparently someone in Twitch I just said apparently Riot has announced that um, the eSport world skins are coming with a prestige version apparently you don't think Scion dying matters yeah the unfortunate thing with Scion it, Scion does reward bad play and he gets so strong regardless it's crazy you very 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 strong champion
they're camping a Draven, which it makes sense. Draven needs to get ahead early. If you put your jungle pressure down there and make it basically a 2v3, he ain't going to get fed. I warned them. Oh. He's alive, but this is all... He's not alive, is he? No, oh my God. He's a Draven and he's getting wrecked in the early game. <laughs> what we call a GG. A Draven is getting wrecked in the early game. Look how aggro they're going. Zed misplayed. Oh no. I should have TP'd bot lane. Oh, he's got no mana. Big shutdowns. Oh, I'm an anti carry. Hey, slightly demented parrot. 45 months of prime says, Hey, Huz, hope you're doing great. I'm not going to be around much for a while as League was taking up too much time in my life, so I'm taking a break. Hope you have a Merry Christmas and puppy life goes amazing. Thank you much, dude. I don't see you before Christmas. Have a great one. But it sounds a bit weird to say because we're in like the first week of November, but have a good time, my dude. It's always good to recognize that type of thing. Lovely. I think Simon was actually killing him solo, by the way. Dude, this Viger can't farm. It's me. <laughs> Dude, I'm so far ahead in farm. The Draven is still sucking, but... And that's a problem. We need Zed maybe to start ganking bot lane. Is the Doggo emote new? Yeah, fairly. Oh my god. Uh, I don't think we can win this game with this Draven. He seems absolutely clueless. Like, yeah, I wouldn't pair an Ash support with a Draven, but I think it's mainly his own play that is making everything go wrong. <sighs> so annoying. I really want to climb. I really want to get master again, but these players are just so bad. <sighs> the good thing is I'm happy with how we're playing, and I've been happy with how I'm playing for quite some time, and that's good. You're happy with how you're playing? There's only so much you can do. Like that, I didn't get that cannon. The tick didn't happen at the right time. No, Seraphine not. Really far behind. Oh my god. Stop inting. Playing so well. I'm playing so well. Dude. What more can I do? Jeez. Ob Goblin 2k gold. I just got all that gold. <laughs> can someone just tell me, is this a Draven player or not? Can you get out of my lane, please? Just get carried, dude. Stop trolling. 
The thing with the Draven player, right? I'm actually worried that he's just going to start running it down because it's a Draven player. That's the really sad thing. 102 games, 49% win rate. Bad Draven player. You don't play 100 games of the champion and have a negative win rate if you should play that champion. Wow. I think Cyan again was going to solo kill him. When will the Honor level 5 Mal skin be available? It will presumably at the end of the season because you have till the end of the season to get the Honor level required for the skin. So they can't give it out before. Right? That makes sense to me. GG. We are literally playing so well. And my bot lane refused to stop inting. Is the Draven a duo player by any chance? Never mind. An enemy has been slain. So close. That was so close to science surviving. too much but at least zed lives he had a bigger shutdown did he have a bigger shutdown no i had a bigger shutdown i had 550 he had 400 oh i shouldn't have done that i had a bigger shutdown than him and the varus is doing more damage and stuff than he should because of how overfed he is from a draven and that sounds so weird to say you know Varus is a scaling champion. Draven is the lane bully. Varus has got Barry. He did use it in that fight. I heard it. I was about to try and dodge that and then I realized one it wasn't an ash arrow and two ashes on my team level 11 oh hello thank you so much oh my god that was insane that is going to be a tilted vi she was just waiting in that bush by the way he was just waiting in that bush. Crazy. This Ash is actually playing really well. So, well, her arrows are good. So, judging off what she's doing, it has to be the Draven that has just played absolutely awfully. He has cleansed. He could have flashed it. Like, look at the Draven. He literally could have flashed the Varasol and lived. Just refuse. Absolute refusal to actually play the game properly. You need to kill the Varus. Nice, and then you can kill them. Hey, Gloomy. Oh, yeah, I need to do your thing. I forgot. Oh, okay. If I can kill the action. Doubt it. 
I don't know, maybe. You think he'll just try to kill the Draven? Okay, I can. Nice shut down for me. I guess he was basing? This Vi has been like mini focusing me this game, but it's only going to get worse because I just keep doing things to this Vi. He's like, so ha 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 ha. Gonna be very angry at me. Like that. She goes for a really weird ulti on me. Oh, the Seraphine all got me. My dot is still on him. Ah, oh, my ult came up at a really bad time. Hey, Vixie. Don't worry, guys. Draven's got it. If I had my ult during that actual fight, we could have won it. My ult came up during it. Damn. Yeah, this Vi is not liking me, which is just... Oh, God. Okay. Should Ash go the AD carry route because how bad the Draven's doing? No. Ooh, this could be good. Draven ult. Missed. <laughs> he missed! Yeah. Okay. This Vi is so tilted. This Vi is so tilted. Oh, arrow! Oh. Draven. Oh my god, he actually did a good E. Oh my god. See if I can go get him. He knows I'm on my way. Don't care. Dude, he does a lot of damage. Got ignite as well. Viger is split pushing. Oh, it's always the bad players that split push. He's done absolutely nothing this game. He's 0 1 0, achieving absolutely nothing, and he's split pushing. It's always those players. Uh, did I also say, Morgan, thank you much for the gifted sub over to Gloomy. That's very kind. Yeah, Viger's dead because he's done some really weird split. What is he doing? Yeah, not sure about that. I'm going to go top, stop the action. Oh, they're going mid. Okay. I've got TP. The Zed does seem good. Did I say I was getting new emotes? No, I just got a puppy one. Poppy. All right, groupy, groupy. This Vi was literally about to go all in on me. <laughs> what are you doing, dude? The tilt is real. Zion, back off, back off, back off, back off, back off. Did Draven just flash on place? No. He is kind of trolling it, but I don't think he's... I don't think he's inting yet, at least. Ash arrow, ash arrow, ash arrow. 
There was a moment I think we could have had an Asher over. Back off, Draven. Akshan. If I leave and you get killed by Akshan, I swear to God. Sorry guys, he's farming top. <sighs> we just have to kill the Varus and win the game. The Viger's got no idea what's going on. He has overstayed the Scion though, which I was worried about. Because I don't know why he overstayed, there was just no need. It does take a million years to kill him, but still. Couldn't be dying for free. This Draven makes me sad. So much damage. Oh. <laughs> we have nothing as follow up here. Oh, Zed is like. Oh, this game is so difficult. Because we genuinely do not have an AD carry. Is Mal's good again? He was all right. And then they gave him that crazy buff for his uh, last hitting, which I really don't know why they did. Well, I don't know. That was like one of his weaknesses, but like it has just made him so much better. Oh, guys. Let's get in there, Scion. Get in there. Distract, distract, distract. Get, give Zed time to get there. Get in there, Scion. In, in. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I saw it happening because the Vi walked away. The Vi walked away. On my way. Now we got Baron, that's fine. Hmm. Press the R, budget didn't go off, unfortunately. This Vi has played really bad this whole game. So literally just kill Varus and we win. He hasn't got a QSS yet. He's been really greedy. <laughs> they were all in the bush. Oh, they're so desperate. Oh my God. My Sonya didn't go off. It's a shame because Sion, if he grouped, he would actually do a lot of damage, but he's just doing the stupid Bows technique. Which is just unnecessary when he could just be in the middle of a team fight and actually kill people. Oh. 
this group up. Because I swear, a, like, Tank Sion is so good at grouping. Demonic damage, only 500. I'm not going to get insane value out of, like, these tank killing things. Because, like, and not, no one's a tank. Ooh, nice life us. I'll add that to the list soon. Yeah, hopefully Sion just thinks a little bit and just starts to group. Because if he split pushes, we, we don't have an AD carry. So, like, we're lacking strength as it is when we're only four people. So we can't risk him not being there. Especially if he doesn't have TP up. If he has TP up, it's not as bad because he can TP over, but he didn't have TP up then. It does seem the Akshan, by the way, is very much focusing me as well. He's starting to build pure MR against me and jumping on me at every team fight, so. Yeah. The annoying thing is, though, the Viger's played really poorly. Because it is Viger, and I know I played Viger last game, but it's one of the strengths of Viger. You can play quite bad. I can't, man. I'm hoping we be winning it, kinda. It's a three for three. I don't want to be ulting the, the Akshan. I want to be ulting the Varus, but it's just the fight that I'm being given at the moment. What's better for Mal's Rabbit or Void? I'd say Void. Most of the time, Void. No one has a heal reduction. Uh, nope. Bork looks weird because apparently they made it look more ruined king -y, king kingy. I don't know. It looks terrible. Whoa. Bork. No, don't in. Please, I want to win the game. Oh, I'm losing my mind. This bot lane has died 20 times. 20 times. So tilting. Never understand how people get to this rating. But... But somebody's tilted. <laughs> well, enemy team just ran it down as much as my bot lane just did. But the difference is the really fed Varus did it. What was that about? I don't know. The one thing the Ash has done well is arrows. I will admit that her arrows have been good. That's about it. Oh. He's got QSS now, by the way. I really don't want to ult him. Still does damage to them, but... Yeah. Don't. Oh. Nice. That's maybe game. What the hell? you guys doing gg let's go we win i forgot to use my pot 
I could have done even more damage. Oh my god. We won. What a weird game. This Draven made this game so difficult. Why would he make it this difficult? Oh, okay. <laughs> Draven carry. Uh -huh. <laughs> nice. I thought, I genuinely thought we were going to lose that game and that would have made me really sad. All right. Only plus 16. That's fine. Right. We're getting away from zero LP. This is great. We're playing really good. Great games on mouths. Good roams. Good shutdowns. Woo. 14,000 damage. He did less damage than his Ash. Wow. We went 11, 6, 10. Zed did the most damage. He had a good game. I did the second most damage in my team. Action 38. He was doing a lot of damage, to be fair. But it's a cheese pick, but whatever. Um, Varus actually did less damage than the Akshan. That does show how much that was doing. And yeah, Veigar 12k. This Veigar had no idea what was going on. Which was an absolute blessing. Alright, let's see. Ah, oh, that's why. It's a one trick. One trick playing a different champion. 33% win rate in 39 games. One trick. So wait, are they a one trick mid Nidley player? I don't know. I'm very confused. So this guy does play a lot of Akshan, but it looks like he is a mid main, so he must have got top lane, so he just still plays Akshan top. Not too much Varus negative KD, but he got fed in lane phase. Negative win rate on Seraphine, and then my team, 11% win rate Ash. Okay. Uh, Sion 33. Well, we should not have won. Oh my god, we should not have won this game. All four of my teammates had negative win rates on their champions. So, like, their personal win rate was negative. All four. Enemy team, positive, positive, neutral, neutral. So, enemy team had three positive. No, two positive, one neutral, two negative. We had one positive, four negative win rates. Oh, oh God, this game. Oh, my God. Anyway, that's going to be it. If you guys enjoyed Crazy Game, thankfully we won. Do throw a like on it, throw a comment, throw a subscribe. And I uh, also, I don't know if I, yeah, I forgot. Sorry, it was just crazy. Pleb name, thank you very much for resubscribing. Eight months tier one says, here's to your best season so far. Thank you very much, my dude. Anyway, that's gonna be it. Like, comment, subscribe. See you guys next time. Goodbye. Call down the reckoning.